afternoon and we need to buy tickets to go back home. We found this little, I don't know what they call it, a little shop that actually sells tickets. We are gonna get them online, but it seemed to be a little bit cheaper, under 30 per person. And it's only a two hour train ride back home versus an eight or nine hour bus ride. It's a little bit more expensive, but it's gonna be a lot better. Let's see if we can grab these right now. Down to our last and we almost didn't make it. That was close. I know, he hooked us up. We almost had to go walk and get cash. I had like exactly 26,650 yen. It was 26,700 yen. He's like, ah, oh, it's all good. But now I gotta go get cash because we have nothing now. Bank gone for seven banks. It's the only place I can take out cash from. They have one right here in the station. Perfect. Oh, uh, life saver. Walked into one of these goodie shops. It's like omiyage stuff to bring home as a gift. Why everything in Japan on display just makes you want it. Like, shows you what it looks like inside, what you're actually getting. They take the time to do that, which is cool. Oh, everything looks so good. Come on. Japan's the best. Thank you. means train station bento. Train station bento. We got this last time we went on Shinkansen. It's amazing. It's not too expensive either. Is that like $10 USD? Oh my gosh. Literally a spot just to get a bento box for the train. Too many options. Kids meals too. I want you to see this. Like the tayero. What? The tayero is like the the doctor for Shinkansen, right? <laughs> the mechanic for Shinkansen? Yeah. This is for the kids. This is a bento. Look, this is a bento. This is cool. For kids. That is cool. Why are you the mad? kids would love it. I wish I could bring it home to them. I know. It's gonna go bad though. Yeah. Alright, I gotta figure out what I'm gonna get. There's way too many. You eat them cold too, yeah? Uh huh. And, and it's it tastes, cold, but it's, it tastes it's amazing. Really good. Yeah. We're literally just walking around the station and there's just so much going on. Another thing I wanted to tell you guys is always make sure you have cash in Japan because a lot of places still only use cash. And that's what I learned here. Cali, I literally don't even touch money. We're gonna get some food before we hit the train. Too many options. Oh my gosh. Oh, I found what I want. Why is this place so big? <laughs> We're gonna go eat okonomiyaki, I think. But look how good this looks. Dude, we have to go here, man. Okay. It looks good. Because we're in Osaka, right? Yep. If you don't know what this is, okay. 
these things are ridiculously fast and it's about a two hour train ride back to Tokyo which is like I think 400 something kilometers I don't know how many miles that is but way better than taking an eight hour bus right <laughs> way better. last time I rode the Shinkansen was what six years ago seven six years ago it's so nice in there I can't wait to show you guys but thank you Osaka what a great time thank you Rob We'll be back soon. This place looks really nice. This is Tokyo Station, the actual station of Tokyo. It is lit. It's pretty lit. I think we're just gonna walk around for a bit before we head home. This place is fancy though. This is the working district, huh? Yeah. Let's see what they have over here. Okay, now we're officially going home, yeah? Yes. Yes, okay, yes. cool. <laughs> Delivery day. Ikea. Got our bed, our couch is coming. I think these are the mattress covers. More Moon Eyes stuff. Literally like $1,000 of Moon Eyes. done that's one room down still have the kids room my room but what do you guys think not bad i got this couch for 700 dollars. i think 750 dollars. i got the table for like eight dollars the carpet was like a hundred i think and the owner obviously left the tv and the tv stand which is great now we gotta do the kids bed and i gotta do my bed too but so far so good this couch is amazing We've been sleeping on the floor for the past like five days. Nothing. So this is good. Well, now we gotta do the kids' room. So, fun begins. Well, my phone died. We tried many different variations for the kids room and seems like this worked out the best we didn't realize how tall the bed was so we put a futon underneath it's kind of like a mini bunk bed 
You know, when you're a kid, that's the funnest stuff ever to have a bed underneath. So far, so good. Next, our bedroom. Japan bedrooms are quite small for the most part because they only use them to sleep. But hey, S15 neighbor. We're gonna start jamming though. Shouldn't be too long. Well, our bedroom's too small to even get the whole thing in the frame. Leah got the wrong size sheets. She forgot to get bed sheets. Sick. So we gotta get new bed sheets, but so far so good. Literally using this room just to sleep in, so I don't need much in here. Downstairs in my office is gonna be where I spend most of my time. This will do though. That's cool. We are slowly getting there. I don't know how I feel about this whole setup. I just wanted to set something up real quick to get an idea uh, what I'm working with, but I've got a bunch of Moon Eye stuff that I haven't opened yet, and I think I might do that really soon. I got these, which are pretty cool. So you don't know which car you're gonna get. They just have a bunch of different ones. I already opened two. I'll show you guys what's inside. I'm a nerd, guys. I thought this was pretty dope, but I wanna put some cars on these. Pretty dope. This one's super dope. Roll cage in there. So good. Let's open the other ones. Very cool. Give me a good one. Oh, we got a good one. We got a good one, guys. Dang, super sick. We'll take them out of the box after. I'm just hoping I don't get the same of any one. Let's see. Oh, we got another different one. So good. All right, last one, guys. Yeah, so these are the Liberty Walk editions. Oh, I got the same one. Oh, this one will go to Momo, because Momo loves blue. Pretty sick though, not gonna lie. Sorry for all the nerd content, I'm just geeking out right now. But, pretty sick. I just got this thing the other day for like 10 bucks. <laughs> Come on. You can't tell me that's not cool. Just the big kid guys, but I got kids too, so they can enjoy this stuff too. <laughs> I have an excuse. I still have so many Hot Wheels to go through. Probably not gonna open any of these, but some other goodies in here too. OG Initial D, Tomika catalog thingamajig. I'm not gonna open this, but. I was gonna call it a night, but I can't wait any longer. I got some Moon Eyes stuff that I want to unbox, and I figured, why not do it in the new living room setup? Ah, oh, I don't even know what's in these boxes. I just ordered a bunch of stuff. It all came at separate times. I don't know what's what. First item, Moon Eyes welcome mat. This thing is so good. I don't even want to put it outside. This is one of those items I just couldn't pass up because new house and all, welcome mat. Needed, much needed. What is this? This is the Moon Eyes Circle floor mat for the office. Super hyped on this thing. Just got a bunch of mats. Oh, I got the Moon Eyes catalog. Magazine. I don't even want to open it. Yokohama Hot Rod. And I got this for the girls. Little Moon Eyes lights. Super dope. Got the Moon Eyes 
What are these antenna balls? A little shaka. I got the OG Moon Eyes ball and the Moon Eyes measuring tape. Oh, this thing's super cool. The Moon Eyes title holder. This is strictly for your car paperwork. You leave it inside your car. Mine's just laying in the glove box. So I figured I needed it. So I got this super unnecessary, but I love it. Oh, this one I was pretty hyped about. Very nice. Rug format. This is for sure going in the office as well. The Moon Eyes V Dub van. And everything is fairly cheap. You guys can check out Moon Eyes uh, Japan's website. I'll link it in the description. No, this is not a paid sponsorship. I just love Moon Eyes. And uh, it'd be great to pick up a sponsor. But no, go ahead and check out their site. Everything is reasonably priced. They ship worldwide, I believe, too. Next box. Let's see. The Moon Eyes storage box. This thing is super sick. Figured I'd get this for the Hot Wheels or something. I don't know. It was only like 300 yen or something. I don't know, guys. Super unnecessary again, but how cool. How cool it is. And they put my stuff inside. Let's check it out. We got the Moon Eyes basket for the garage. Probably didn't need this. Open this guy. We got the Moon Eyes little microfiber towel. The Moon Eyes coin purse. Must have. Use coins a lot in Japan, so I needed this. And the comb. Didn't need this at all. Just thought it looked super cool. So I got it. What do we got here? We have the we have the key cover. I got a pen. I got two pens. This is a touch pen. Copper, it looks like. Dang, this is a really nice pen. Office pen, garage pen. Needed it. Let's see what else we got. We've got more Moon Eye stuff. <laughs> the mouse pad. See this side, it's upside down. Handle with care, thank you. What did I order, what is this? Oh! How cool is this? This is so sick. Sick, you're going right here, buddy. And I bought quite a bit of gloves. I think I made another order because I forgot I bought gloves. These are my new mechanics gloves. I got some snap-on ones and they ripped super fast, surprisingly, they're snap-on. My Supreme ones disappeared, no clue where they went. So I was in need of new mechanics gloves. Thank you, Moon Eyes. And a bunch of these, these are super cheap. The regular knitted style with the Moon Eyes grip on the bottom. I think these are like 300 yen each or something. So I bought three of them. This is another basket I ordered the wrong size. So I'm stuck with two small baskets, but that's okay. I can use it for something. Maybe the kids can use it. This is the box I just placed an order for the other day. I ordered quite a bit of stuff, pulled the trigger without even thinking twice. Probably shouldn't have. As you can see, the invoice is very long, quite expensive. But worth it. Guys, we've got the Moon Eyes pillow for the new couch. I wasn't sure how big it was, but pretty decent size. Put that right behind me. Oh, I think I know what this is, guys. I needed a clock for the garage or the office. This is amazing. It's that brush metal around the edges. Love this tote bag just for enough groceries probably got to get a couple more I thought they were a little bit bigger love it super sick got the set these are cheap too I think these were like 300 400 yen each so they gave us some 
Moon fans. Sick, it's pretty hot in here actually. I was hyped on this. I don't know if you can see the full thing in the, in the frame, but we got the Moon Eyes five gallon bucket for the garage and we got more stuff inside. We got the beer koozie. What is this? We've got the little cooler also for grocery shopping. Keep all your meats nice and cool. Little thermos holder koozie thing for, I don't know, the kids drinks or something. <laughs> Along with the big bucket, we got the small bucket. What's inside the small bucket? Got a bunch of little goodies for the house, for the kitchen, cups, big mugs, little mugs. Before we wrap this up, I wanna show you guys the last package, my favorite package of them all. You guys get it? Kind of know what it is. Oh yeah, the Moon Eyes chair. Guys, how sick is this? My buddy had one back in the day. I thought it was the coolest thing ever, and I finally got my hands on one. They are a little bit pricey. They're like 200 bucks or something, but how sick. I mean, such a good garage piece. I'd have to say my most favorite items out of this whole run was the Moon Eyes chair and the Moon Eyes clock. Let me know what you guys think down below. Thanks for watching. I know that was kind of a long segment on today's vlog, but I had to share with you guys. I'm super pumped. I feel like a kid on Christmas. I can't wait to put everything up around the house. Then we can do a full house tour. Literally been waiting like a week to open up this stuff and Figured we got the living room set up, so this is the perfect time to do it, right? Thank you guys for watching. Back to your normal vlogs. I got another chair for the dining room table. Five bucks. Let's go. Little desk for upstairs. And I got me a sofa for $30 for my office. This is perfect. It folds out into a food dome. <laughs> it's good. Now I just gotta get this in the house. We can do that full house tour soon. Promise. The last piece of the puzzle. Let's go, baby. GT racing. I don't know, this seat had like 30,000 reviews on the Amazon, so I figured it might be good. Let's get this thing assembled. good. I don't need three logos so I flipped this one backwards. I don't know if I'm gonna use this but it does feel good on your back when you sit down so now I can edit. I usually take about eight hours to edit a video so I needed a chair. This chair was absolutely brutal on my back so so I have to have a new editing chair more like a gaming chair and I don't even game but Time to start editing. Ah.